Ironhide here, weapons ready. Ironhide here, weapons ready. Ironhide here, weapons ready. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm flexing Studio Series Ironhide, whatever. I got him when he came out. Deal with it. Anyways, today we have just a, a petite paquette. <laughs> Wonder how many people I just infuriated. Um, who, who's this from again? It's from T Volk. All right. Uh, he said, "Hey man, I'm sending you a package. Uh, it's coming all the way from good old British Columbia." <clears throat> and uh, yeah, I'm so sorry. It's like ten o'clock at night, and um, I didn't bring a knife. So, um, hmm. And it's like, I could just get up and get a knife, but turns out I have a stress fracture in my foot. So I've got one of those boots on right now, and I really don't want to get up. <laughs> so, don't worry, I'm fine. Um, I just gotta wear a boot for like, geez, I think they said like four weeks. Um, and I've never worn a boot before. Ah, oh, geez, okay. Um, this is not, I, I need to get a knife. I got the knife! Um, I hope I don't cut any contents. But yeah, I've got a boot right now. <laughs> and, um, they're, it, it, I mean, it's not that bad. It really isn't. It? It's, it's not. Um, I mean, of course, I'm in America, so worst part about it's probably going to be how much it costs. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, gotta put your health first, dude. Gotta put your health first. And I literally have a fracture in my foot. <laughs> so, all right, this is really entombed, isn't it? Really entombed. Ooh, I don't even know what's in here. Very entombed. Um, that was totally unnecessary to tear that. Um, Alright, so we've got some paper stuff first. Let's look at the paper. The paper products. That's my name. Now I had to look like, is, <laughs> is uh, an address on the other side? Uh, no, it is not. Alright. Let's cut this open and not tear it up. Whoops, too late. Ooh, already seen some good looking Cody fan art. Ooh. Oh man, that's sweet. Yes, my lord. Execute order 66. Dude, that's awesome. I love that. Wow. Definitely gonna hang that up whenever I get around to hanging up my stuff. Because uh, <laughs> I have so much art that I have not hung up. That's really sweet, man. Then there's something else as well. JCC2224, I've been a fan of yours since 2015. And I thought, well, I've actually been a fan of myself a little longer than that. So step it up. Uh, <laughs> and I thought it was about time I sent you something. So here are some random Star Wars things. Um, there's also a drawing of Cody for you. Sincerely from Person. Um, <laughs> from Person. Instagram to, uh, 212th Commander Cody. Thank you so much, man. And check out his Instagram. D is it Durson? Because I read it as person. <laughs> I think it might be Durson. I'm so bad with names. I'm very, very bad with names. But from now on, if everyone just addresses letters from person, that would be hilarious. Just saying. Check out 212th Commander Cody on Instagram. And let's see what he has sent along. We got a bag of stuffs. Eh. Is there anything else? No, that is it. Let us look. Let us see what is inside. Ooh, I'm excited. Hmm. All right. So reaching into the bag, first we have... Oh, no! Oh, no! Um, it's actually kind of hilarious, though. Um, and that actually works really well. Um, he ain't got no hair. But seriously, um, I might use this to actually make, like, a custom you know, battle-damaged Anakin. Because that works, you know? I could make... Oh, that'd be so cool if I added, like, glue to him and made it look like fire or something. Oh, I might, I might do that. Uh, <laughs> like, have you seen how people, like, use hot glue or something and, like, make these really cool, like, shapes and everything out of it? That would be super cool. That'd be a super cool custom. That's definitely going in the bin and definitely going to be a future idea. Let's see what else we got. Oh, there's his hair! There's his hair. That's good. That's really good. Because <laughs> I was kind of like, I'll have to put a lot of fire in, on his head to make it look like his hair's on fire. But nah, got the hair. Oh, that's sweet. Definitely, definitely an idea I got to keep in mind. Ooh, this is a Commander Cody jetpack 
from the Commander Cody Clone Wars figure. Ooh, that's really useful, man. Thank you. Wow, that is awesome, dude. I really appreciate that. It's definitely something good to have an extra of. And then we have... Oh, no. And he's missing a hand. Even though I do have to say, that's some of the best paint on uh, one of these helmets that I've seen in a while. But yes, even though he is missing a hand, um, I will add him to my ranks of five POA Commander Codys that I now have, like, three of now. <laughs> So, please, everyone, send me your Commander Cody's. I will, I will be their home. That's cool. What else we got? Ooh, one of these. Uh, do I have this exact one? I don't. I'm not sure if I do. I have one very similar. Um, even if like I already do have this one, I've been meaning to paint up one of these. This is a Star Wars Command clone trooper from that like sort of Army Men game. Yeah, I might paint that up. That's really cool, man. Thanks. I've actually... <laughs> I didn't want to paint up the only one I had, so... That's awesome. Then, mmm... Yoda. This is a really cool Yoda figure. Um, it's not super great. But it's... I don't know. They released it in a lot of different ways. And I ended up with, like, two of it as a kid. And it's it's not bad. It's not a bad Yoda. It's for it's uh, from Revenge of the Sith. So that's something. But yeah, I mean, that's cool. I'll always take another... Mmm... Catch a mean I need. All right, what else we got? We got. Oh no, Obi Wan's missing a head and hands. Oh no. Oh oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay, we're good. I thought both of his wrists had broken off in there, <laughs> but no, they're hollow. Yeah, this might be good for something too, man. Wow, thanks. Got some clone armor pieces. That might be really useful. I'd really appreciate that. I really need to get into, like, some more kit bashing. Because it's like I have a big old thing of figures now. And, ooh, Star Wars Command Vulture Droid. That's cool. I don't know if... I don't think I have that yet. I might, but I'm not sure. I mean, I think that was it. Yes, that was it. Thank you so much, dude. Sent along some good uh, little custom goodies. Very cool project I'm looking forward to. <laughs> Very much looking forward to this. Here, I gotta get a thumbnail. I, I always forget to get like a good thumbnail for these. That'll that'll be that'll be the thumbnail. There we go. It's Anakin. He's all like I might like draw some fire on him. It'll look really good. Believe me. Um, I see you did that thing though, where like you you probably got an Anakin with like the uh, more articulated arms and all that, and swap the heads. This is a really good Anakin figure though. I remember um, when this came out. Does he have? I think they did a variant with the eyes, right? Either that or all of his eyes are yellow. Yeah, because he's got the yellow eyes. Man, that's super cool. <laughs> I, love it. I love how he looks when he's bald. It's one of the first times Hasbro decided to do, like, separate hair. Um, and now they do it with, like, almost everything now for 6-inch. So, yeah, definitely an interesting figure. The uh, Vintage Collection slash Saga Collection, or Saga Legends Anakin. Um, one of my favorites. One of my absolute favorites. So I think it's pretty cool because I just I just did that video about like all the Darth Vader like battle damaged ones. So now I can actually have like another version of Anakin in my collection. I can have him when he's all dismembered and everything. So awesome, dude! Thanks. And we got some other custom fodder as well. Got a Coderman missing. Uh, oh, can we? No, I don't think. Oh yeah, because it had like the chest harness, so we can't like combine. But yeah, we've got Cody. We've got a clone that I'll paint. We got a yogurt. We've got some awesome artwork that I can't really like properly display, so I'll just set it like that. And yeah, there we go. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much, person. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm horrible. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. Again, check out 212 Commander Cody on Instagram. I think that was what it was. Here it is again, just in case I got it wrong. Because my memory is literally that of a goldfish. Uh, <laughs> at least I acknowledge it. I've seen some P.O. Box videos where they're like, I don't know who this is from. I didn't see anything. But uh, thank you. And they put like no effort in actually seeing who it was from. Uh, <laughs> here is my P.O. Box address if you wish to send me anything. It, 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 this is it. Right here. This is my, my P.O. Box address. I check it like every Thursday. That's what I do. It's like I, I just go to my post office every Thursday or Friday or like whenever and I'm like do I have something sometimes I'm like oh yeah I do and other times I'm like oh but it's okay <laughs> alrighty guys thank you so much for watching I've been rambling long enough um can you hear that that's my it's my boot 
hear that? My boot makes noise. All right, I'll let you go. I'll see you guys. Bye. <laughs>